The development of cell theory is a complex journey with many contributors. Robert Hooke in 1665 coined the term cell after observing cork through a microscope. He thought they resembled the small rooms monks lived in. In the 1670s, Antony van Leeuwenhoek observed living microorganisms, which he called animalcules, in pond water and other substances using a more powerful microscope. In 1838, botanist Matthias Schleiden concluded that all plants are made of cells. A year later, in 1839, zoologist Theodor Schwann extended Schleiden's findings to animals, proposing that all living things are composed of cells. Finally, in 1855, Rudolf Virchow declared that all cells come from pre-existing cells, famously stating omnis cellula e cellula. This disproved the then popular idea of spontaneous generation. The wacky history of cell theory is a testament to human curiosity and the relentless pursuit of knowledge